much, Jordan. Well, Salt Lake County Leaders and Family Support Center planting more than 3,500 blue pinwheels, each representing one child who is a confirmed victim of child abuse in Salt Lake County last year. Now, a telling visual of just how many children are impacted by abuse. ABC4's Ali Rulian has that story today. I am standing in the midst of 3,741 blue pinwheels. That's 3,741 confirmed cases of child abuse in Salt Lake County. And that doesn't account for all of the cases that haven't been confirmed and the children that are still being abused. A call to the community today. Listen, children will let you know if there is something wrong. Thousands of blue pinwheels spinning in the wind, a reminder of the victims of child abuse. So there's many kids that still haven't got the strong enough to report it, or their parent has it, or they think it's the norm. One of the people planting pinwheels in the ground, Heidi Lund, a survivor of child abuse. But I didn't really understand the grasp or grasp what kind of abuse I was really having um, until I got out of it. She says she's also a parent who struggled in the past with a cycle of substance abuse and went to Family Support Center to get help. I started there and I never even had a job before when I first moved in there. Like I sold drugs because that's what I was taught. Now she's the director of their Life Start Village and teaches others what she learned to turn her life around. I want to get you to be okay, me alone, so you're not going to settle to be in those unhealthy relationships. Salt Lake County leaders saying neglect is the number one cause of abuse. But there are resources for parents to get help that you shouldn't be ashamed of. And it's everyone's responsibility to look out for our children. Lund saying the main difference between now and her childhood, happiness. I thought like happiness only came every once in a while or like if everything was going good in the family, if nobody, like that's what I thought happiness was at the time. Um, and now to like wake up and I'll struggle, but I'm still happy. And for resources for child abuse prevention, you can find that on our website, abc4.com. In Salt Lake, I'm Ali Rulian, ABC4 News.